What's up guys, it's D-Tang here, and today I'm going to show you kind of what it's like in a somewhat normal day, I guess as a professional bowler. Hope you enjoy. So, we're playing some golf today. Bears Best, one of the nicest courses here in Vegas. This is the fifth out of, I think, the last six days I'm playing golf. This is not a normal occurrence, but when people ask me to play golf, I can't really say no. So, that's what we're doing today. Stay tuned. All right, we made it to Bears Best. I've played this course once before, and it's, uh, it's a really nice course. But the crazy thing about this golf course is the houses surrounding it. Absolutely insane. Probably all worth minimum million dollars, ranging upwards to seven, eight, ten million dollars. I was in awe the first time I played here. I think it's gonna be a goal to own one of these houses one day. Today's playing partner, Yeet! Marshall Kent, brought to you by Yakima, Washington. We're also playing with my buddy Nick and his dad. They got the reservation here at Bears Best, so thank you to them. And we're gonna hit B -O -S. bombs. B -O -M -S. bombs. After we roll some putts, because that's really important. Three nut drives off the tips. <laughs> the day can only get worse. <laughs> I just gotta keep pointing out the fact that that's a nice house. This is a new build. Yeah, I'm buying this one. It was like 2.1 million, um, 4,700 square feet. I'm just BSing you. I have no idea what this house is like, but. All right, so we're coming up on the fourth hole here at Bears Best, and I have a funny story. <laughs> so, I chunked one. It was like a hundred and, I don't even remember what, how far this hole was, but I chunked it, I had like 30 to the, the greenish, and there's a house over there. I think I'm pointing at it, and there's a lot of glass over there. I'm like, Marshall, do I hero shot it? Do I flop it? And he's like, yeah, of course, always hero shot. Always. always. So I go for it, I thin it, it goes like 130 yards at the house, and as soon as I hit the ball, my hands went on my head, and I was like, no, we probably missed the house by this much. And that's my one funny story on this course. Darren Tang on the tee box on 11. Holds a two-stroke lead. Let's go with the driver. Should carry this 260. Let's gonna try to put a little baby draw on it. Let's see what it does. Oh, and it is high, high, high. I don't think he likes it that much. Just to be right. I don't think he likes his lie. My hand's taking an unplayable. Out of house. That was the shot shape I was looking for. It wasn't the right Solid day of golf for sure. Shot 91. We did play from the tips and we also played desert golf. So compared to where I normally play, I think that evens out sort of. One over bogey golf. I'll take that for now, any day of the week. I'm gonna go head to the nerd, get some practice in. So we'll see you there. Yeah. We're at the nerd, High Life Lanes. And look who we ran into. Yeah, let's go. Practice. Not falling in the lane anymore. Boy. Practice time. He's gonna practice not falling. Yeah. We're in the nerd, High Life Lanes. We're gonna get some practice in, do some physical work. I'm working on getting my hand underneath it more. I'm trying to get my shoulder a little more connected to my body. Those are some main things I'm working on. I'm also working on my timing. We gotta get ready for this TOC PTQ. We haven't won a tournament yet, so we can't just bowl the tournament. It's the most stressful tournament of the year for me, so we gotta be ready. All right, I'm sure many of you are curious about how I warm up my practice regimen. Right now I'm doing that one, two, three, four step drill. Well, I'm basically just focusing on my timing and then I'll move on to focusing on be more compact with my upper body, stabilization, probably more timing drills with my feet focused instead of uh, timing focused by isolation. You know, it kind of depends on how I'm feeling, what I'm seeing. I take a lot of videos so I can review. Make sure you're taking video if you want to get better. You need something to look at because what you're feeling is probably not gonna be the same as what you're actually doing. That's my number one tip for you guys.
Uh, for me, I'm working on redirecting the momentum of my balance arm to keep my left shoulder forward a little better. So I always fight, my balance arm starts going up and high and back. Right shoulder goes forward, elbow gets out, hand gets me outside, ball never hooks to the same spot twice. If I redirect it, go lower, keeps the left shoulder forward, right shoulder back, it gets the hand in a much stronger position where I can actually get a consistent ball reaction. So yeah. I'm doing a bunch of one strip drills to get the feel of it. I'll probably go to three steps and then I'll do a full, full process after probably 100 shots. Nice. So. Swing tips with Marco Kelly. Yeah. Bowling so frustrating sometimes. You work on drills, you just keep pounding away at them and it doesn't feel right, but you gotta do them because if you don't do them, you don't get better. That's why we do them. But plus, I mean, if you just focus on the drills, when you come back to actually throwing shots, it feels way better. And if, you, if it doesn't feel better, then practice a different way. two-handed. Let me know in the comments if you think it's good. You're supposed to roll two out every time, I thought. That would say end on a okay. good one. We just finished practice on our way to get some dinner. What about eight o'clock? We're getting beat dubs. Yo, just wrapped up a nice dinner with Jesse. We had some good conversations, very productive. We're looking forward to creating bigger and better videos, but beat dubs is all right. Like I said, I was kind of stupid with the buy one, get one. So I got some extra wings in the fridge, but that's not a bad thing, right? <sighs> That's a typical day for me. I don't play golf a ton, but I have been lately. I didn't fit a workout in today, which is gonna shame on me, but I'll be okay. We'll get a little more disciplined. We'll start working out, fit them in, prioritizing that over golfing. But I got one more round of golf tomorrow, so tomorrow's schedule will be more or less the same. Wake up, golf, practice, come home, stream, which is what I'm about to do. I'm gonna edit this video on stream, twitch.tv slash vitamin D tang. Feel free to click the link down below and join us. But until the next vlog, bye.